بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى عليه وصحبه وسلم أما بعد حبت في الله from the ways in which the shaytan distorts our youth and helps to deviate our youth is through the various types of stimulus that we find around the world whether that be the video games, the television, the movies, the internet pornography, all of the various things that you may view and, and, and uh, listen to. And all of the want and quest and journey for, material, for materialism. This is also a thing that corrupts our hearts and the hearts of our youth. And so <clears throat> these are very difficult challenges. And I think they are challenges in which we on a level which humanity hasn't faced prior to this time, that now the access to evil is greater and the movement to exalt evil is more. So there's an increase in things to make you not remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So in order to provide for our youth, the youth need proper Islamic knowledge and the knowledge that they <clears throat> they need they need to know why they're worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and how to love Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and how to love worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala not just simply memorizing the Quran and memorizing the text but you need to we need to find ways to uh, to gain their hearts back in loving the deen and this is affirmed for us in many texts from the book and the sunnah, but from the sunnah of the Messenger of Allah that I can think of right now is that the Prophet said, In fi jizid mudra, ida salaha salaha jizid kullu, wida fasidat fasidat jizid kullu, ala wahiya qalb. The Prophet said, Verily in the body is a morsel of flesh. If it is, if it is healthy, then the whole body is healthy. If it is sick, then the whole body is sick. Verily, it's the heart. So we see here that the heart is where a lot of us are falling short. And many people, even from righteous parents and righteous households, they try their best to, to raise their children with all these obstacles and hurdles and challenges and new threats in ideology, in sexuality, in, in everything. And I think one of the things that some of us are missing is actually spending time with the, with the children and, and, and the youth and in raising them. And sometimes it's very, I mean, it's impossible because the, the parents are working, they have difficulties or difficulties or challenges in relating to them. Uh, there, there's so many things out there, but there are some things that we have to try to do in order to gain the hearts of the youth in order to, te to, to try to, bless, to give them the tools to, have, to be able to protect their hearts in such uh, hostile environments. We ask Allah the Almighty <clears throat> to bless us with the with ilm al nafi rizq and taybo and the tools to guide us and our families and our communities and protect them from kufr, shirk, nifaq, and zambaqa, and ilhad and all of the types, various types of ma'asi and things which corrupt their faith.